Oh, he's right there. Holy. Where? Is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a big one. We're set up now we're just trying to let the water clear a little bit i've actually had a couple times where i've had pike come in uh, two of them at a time but they're smaller and they're coming in a little bit lower so it's kind of a long throw i missed a couple here already but i've got my uh sidekick with me today what do you think about this is it pretty fun yeah did you get kind of excited when you saw that little one coming in there yeah. so just trying to introduce uh, youngster to this sport. I was just talking with a friend of mine on the phone a little bit ago and he's, that spearing is an old man sport, but I'll tell you what, call me an old man then, because this is a riot. It is so much fun watching these fish come in, you know, sometimes missing, but uh, it's pretty exhilarating when you, when you put those tines through one. Little guy, little guy. Oh, I can't see him. I think I missed him yes, too. I got him. I got him. Oh. Uh... Yep, yeah, I got him. Yep, yeah, I got him. did. Oh! Barely got him. Oh, Boy, I got they're him. coming in so low. Another one. Some of the fish that we're wanting to take out of this population. So, we're going to get this one bled out. Set up for the next one. Just working this decoy a little bit. It seemed to... Some smaller ones have been really aggressive. Come in and smashed it and then left before it could even get a throw in. But... So we're just kind of experimenting with depths a little bit. We've let it sit. They've come into it sitting. They've come into it shortly after, giving it a little bit of a jig. So. Yep, here it is, here it is. Wow. Yeah. Got him, huh? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, he's not very big, Woo! but he's got fillets. That's what we're after is fillets. Is that the same one you think that you saw a bunch of times? I think so. Number three on the ice anyway, getting rid of some of these little hammer handles. Right below your feet. See him? He's staring right at the decoy. Can you see him? Ready? Get him? Yeah, I've, he turned as soon as I, as soon as I uh, threw though. But I, yeah, I got him. Is that the same one you think that you were looking at the whole time? No. No? The other one was bigger? Yeah. This is, the other one was smaller than this. So. He was smaller than that one? Oh, we don't want that one then. That's too small. He was like that one right there. He turned as soon as I threw, but I still got him. Well, it slowed down a little for us here this afternoon now. We switched out decoys and just trying a few different things. We had a couple more walleyes come swimming through. And another dogfish that I was standing on my spear cord and short stroked him. So... We're just waiting here for another one. This is a pretty good time. Yeah. I think you're gonna get a spear when you get a little bit bigger. Yeah. Yeah, this is a very, very fun, fun pastime because it's so visual. You get to see everything that's going on. You know, fishing is great too, but actually being able to see the fish come in, that's pretty cool. I don't know if you guys can see it, but the, the light reflects off these fins and that's a lot of what attracts these fish too. Oh, he's right there. Holy. Where? Is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Yeah, that's a big one. That's a big one. And I just was gonna put down my underwater camera. Yeah, that's a 30 incher. That's a big one. Oh, we gotta try and get him up without losing him. That's a big one, Courtney. That's a big one right there. Oh, 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 oh that's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big northern right there. Wow, that's the biggest northern I've ever speared. <laughs> I wish I'd have had my camera down the hole for that one. That's a nice northern. They just came from right there. Yep. That way. <laughs> He's 30 anyway. <laughs> that's a nice one. Darn it, I didn't get that. That camera wasn't going either. Wow. It just came right in. I'm like... Well, folks, that's a pretty good size northern for this lake. I'm going to say he's probably 32 inches or so. Uh, now with the slot, now we got to really be careful. Because there's a slot uh, on this lake. So. so my friend Scott that lives in this lake came out to spear with us for the rest of the afternoon. The fish were cooperating and Scott got to spear a couple as well. Oh yeah, nib on the duca. You gonna get him? Yep. <laughs> you know, you're gonna get him. Oh, you side, side swiped him. Holy cow. <laughs> we were hoping to maybe find one more big fish towards evening. Oh, it, I could you could just see him hunting. I saw him turn back there. He made just a big swipe, and then he was just sitting there, and then just yeah. nosing in. I was like, "Oh, move in just a little bit more, buddy." <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah. Aren't you glad we didn't? I, leave I, now? I just, I just slowly started going over the hole. I didn't want to spook him. I was like, "Don't move," you know. So I was like slowly moving. I saw it. I saw him when you. When you speared him, I could see him. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was so cool. It's so cool when you spear them when you know they're just hunting. Yep. You know? That's going to make an awesome, awesome video. 